Hi, it's Chester Tuckwell at Blue Pecan Computer Training. In this video, we're going to look at the DAX function called Related Table. Related Table, here's our scenario. I have a list of products here, and I want to know how many times each product appeared in a sales tri transaction. So to get that information, I need to go to the sales table. And what I'm after is in how many rows do each of these products appear in. I'm not after the quantity sold, I'm after the occurrence of that product in this column. So here we go, this is what we do. I go back to my product table, which is my list of unique products, and I'm going to use the DAX function called related table. Now what related table does is it asks you which table do you want to return rows from. Now we want to return rows from the sales table. But what it does is it uses this as the filter. So it's not going to return all the rows, it's going to return the rows that relate to that value there, the product value. Now I need to count those rows to know in how many transactions that product appeared. So I can use another DAX function called count rows. And that will do the job for me. Just need to name my column, uh, number of transactions, and I'm done. So there's a Nice application for the related table function and just to throw it in as an extra, the count rows function. It's Chester Tuggle at Blue Pecan Computer Training. Hopefully that's been helpful.